My name is Annie Ashton. I'm the wife of Luke Ashton, who died from gambling-related suicide in 2021. I wasn't aware of it until three weeks after his death. I received his phone back and I was able to open up his gambling app. And that is when I discovered Luke had been gambling over 120 times a day. He'd been gambling for 14 hours straight and it, de it destroyed him. Some of the products themselves are so highly addictive, but then they're portrayed as being entertainment, like it's inevitable that you are going to gamble. You might not even know that someone is suffering from a gambling addiction because it's so isolating to that person, and that's because they blame themselves. The idea around victim blaming the individual for an addiction created by the industry is disturbing. It's something that needs to stop. Gamble Aware, the most powerful charity within the gambling harm sector. They should be there to help people, but in actual fact, they are funded by the very industry that is causing the harm in the first place. To me, that's as bad as a tobacco company funding um, cancer research and treatment. You just don't put the two together. I'm asking the Charity Commission to investigate Gamble Aware. I think people need to know the truth about gambling harms.